During your foundation growth, before you head off into your first 365 days of success, there are tasks to secure your mission. In this video, we're going to go over your three needs of success and why you need to focus on them while you grow your financial foundation. Do you have what it takes to make the right left to you? If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel for videos to educate, entertain, and enlighten. Before we get into it, I would like to define success for this particular video series. Success is being able to earn a living within your field of interest. A living is not a comfortable lifestyle. A living is working off of a budget to maintain a growing lifestyle. The three needs of success are network, market, and practice. Together, these three needs help construct a moral foundation, helping to establish a business relationship with your audience. This is accomplished through your personality and your presentation as a whole. Those two things combined, well, that is networking and marketing. However, practicing your skill is not the same as having a talent. And additionally, you are practicing more than your craft. You want to enhance other needed skills to succeed in your field of interest, such as your management of time, money, and people. Moving on, networking is building and cultivating relationships within your circle of influence. And marketing is designing a brand to build awareness, which creates interest that ultimately generates sales. And sales is people buying into your brand's overall message. Now, networking is about who you know. But if they don't know who you are, then what's the point? And that's where marketing comes in. Marketing is about who knows you. And combined, they help elevate a better chance at success. Because you may know the right people, but if they don't know you, it limits your abilities to create opportunities. So if you know the right people and they know you, now you're opening doors. Because people want to work around individuals they enjoy. They like working with their friends so work on building a positive reputation with these people because the truth is people will always invest their time and money into other individuals they feel they will get a strong roi also known as your return on investment in this case you are the brand yourself and people are investing their time and money into that specific brand so while you're at it you should be practicing how to network and market building and cultivating relationships, and developing brand value within those relationships. You should also learn to practice other skills and tools to help better your opportunities and chances within your field of interest. Helpful tip! Think of your three needs of success like this. First, you're building relationships to earn friendships because these friendships will now offer better opportunity to get involved. And of course, the more you get involved, the more you have an opportunity to build your brand value with these individuals. Because your overall message in life, which is your brand, is hopefully building an emotional connection to these people. So they buy into your brand's message and remember you. So always bring value to every relationship and all working situations. Because that will lead to moments where you are called up to play the game with the team. And when you do get called up to play with the team, make sure that you can play the game at the bare minimum. Basically practice to the point where you can at least hit the ball and get on first base. It's not about being the best, but it's being able to at least play the game. More importantly, you should know how the game works. You should understand the ins and outs of that particular field of interest, because the more you know, the more resources you can bring, because your knowledge of the scenarios will be more useful and always know your worth as a person while well, building and cultivating relationships do not allow people to walk all over you but also if you understand your worth don't try to take more than you can handle understand your skill level and overall let them see the value of your worth through your actions saying you are awesome amazing unique is not as impressive as showing how awesome and amazing and unique you truly are and these are things that could be done by simply showing how capable you are and how knowledgeable you are within the field of your interest, both mentally 
and with your capability to perform. Thank you for watching this video and supporting these traveling adventures of a resilient entertainer. Please like, comment, and share, along with subscribe for future content. Have questions? Let me know in the comments below. And also, when sharing, please at Thomas J. Beleza on anything that you share, and I will be happy to return the favor and share some of all things. As always, don't work too hard, but be productive. And when and where you can, work together, grow together, and therefore you shall rise together. Do you have what it takes to make a ray left here? Uh, do you, punk? Uh, do you? I uh, do you. Oh dear.